creating cycles. In order to create a cycle in Flash, you would first have to create drawings and then convert those drawings into a symbol, uh, whether that's a graphic or a movie clip. And then you'd set up how you'd like your animation to be, then bring that animation back to the timeline, then extend it on the timeline for as long as you'd like the cycle to last. Now, to create a cycle in Toon Boom Harmony, one of the things you have to understand is drawings in Toon Boom Harmony are much more powerful than, say, a graphic symbol in Flash. So I'm going to simply grab my paintbrush tool. And this first layer here, I'm just going to simply draw out my circle. And I want to turn on the onion skin for this layer. And now I'll go ahead and select the very next frame and draw another circle. Just tracing this as close as I can. And the next frame, do the exact same thing. Now, one of the first things I'm going to do is I'll select all three of these frames I've just drawn. Hold on my Shift key. Click. And I want to extend the exposure, basically placing each of these drawings uh, putting them on twos in animation terms, meaning I want each of these to take up two frames. So I can right click and I go to exposure, set exposure to two. So now each drawing is taking up two frames. Now I'm gonna select all six of my frames here. Click the first frame, hold down my shift key, click the last frame. And I want to right click and create cycle. Now, because I have the default set up for 60 frames, I'll just make this go for 10 cycles. And I'll click OK. Let's turn off my onion skin. And I'll simply click play. And I'll turn on my loop button. And there's my cycle in Toon Boom Harmony. And again, I've used no symbols to do this. This is just using the drawings in Harmony.